When I joined the MAC team two years ago, it was part of this initiative to get back on the MAC. We have a lot of brands with a lot of great content, and when the iPhone SDK came out, we saw the great opportunity to be able to bring our products to that platform. One of our big products from the Mac has been AOL Radio, and so we said, we've got this AOL desktop client, I wonder if we could get it running on the iPhone. And so one of the developers went off and, you know, within 24 hours was able to get streaming audio playing on the iPhone. So between Thursday and Monday, we were able to come up with an application for AOL Radio. And then within a week, we were able to have Shoutcast Radio working on the iPhone as well. We were able to do it so quickly because the iPhone SDK is very similar to the desktop tools that we use. And we were able to leverage a lot of the code that we had for the desktop app and put that into the iPhone application. I think it's really important that you're able to have a very fast process in order to be able to stay competitive. It's challenging to keep up with all the different things that are out there. With a small team, we were working on a lot of products at the same time. You know, hallway conversations turn into brainstorming sessions, and then the next thing you know, we're bleeding over into the war room, and we're talking about designs, or we're drawing things on whiteboards. And we're able to sit down with the designers and the product people, and with the interface builder up and the application up, we kind of make changes right on the fly. The fact that all this is built into the SDK makes it so we don't actually have to worry about the mechanics. We can just focus more time on the features that we're developing. Then the next thing you know, we're releasing another application. Every time we submit an application, I'll find myself checking the portal to be like, has it been approved yet? Oh, it's in review. Oh, I can't wait. You know, And then to actually see it approved and be able to go to the developer and say, oh, your app got approved iPhone SDK has definitely changed the way that we work. We're doing things a lot faster. We think about our product releases in shorter product cycles, and we're able to take more risk in our applications. And it's exciting for us to be able to see, like, you know, that people are excited too, and they can't wait, and they can't wait to see what new things we have to offer. I'm Christina Wick, Technical Director for the AOL Mac team.